Let's go ahead and take a look outside here on what has been a pretty comfortable mm -hmm. evening. Yeah, Chief Meteorologist Ashley Brown joining us now, but some changes are on the way. Yes, um, showers and storms, but the temperature trend remains mild. Um, my mother called me this morning, mm -hmm. and she asked me um, what she thought was a very important question. And what did is, Glennis have to ask? She said, when are we going to get to the point where we stop dropping down in the daytime to the 30s and 40s? So I, I, think that, I, mean, that's Glenn, I think that's a good question mm -hmm. by Glennis. We're there. Okay. So last week we did have an upper 30 and 40 degree day into last week. But moving forward, as I look at the next 10 to 15 days, I don't see that anymore. Mm. I see that our cold days are now 50 degree days mm. and not upper 30 and 40 degree days. Okay? Were you nice when you delivered that message to, to me? Um, yes, okay. always. I, know. I don't know. Um, <laughs> I mean, I was nice as I could be. Like, yeah. I'm like, hey, I think we're there. She's yeah. like, are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> I think we're there. Um, all right, so and how I know that is is because we have a cold front passing through this week, and our temperatures don't fall too far. So when that cold front stops doing that kind of damage, where we stop dropping to the 30s and 40s, and we see that happening this week, so um, I would say overall we're looking pretty good. But rain on radar right now. Isolated showers and a few thunderstorms as well with some heavier downpours out there for us as we look at where the – heavier downpours are, um, we can zoom in just a little bit, uh, mainly south of Interstate 70. You'll see Bloomington and heavier downpours um, as you look around Martinsville over into Spencer there. Pretty good downpour headed towards Avon, Indiana. These showers are not widespread. They're incredibly isolated. As far as our forecast goes, we'll get some rain cooled air and we'll cool down. Now, 71 was our daytime high today. We're seeing more 70s in this week's forecast than we are seeing 50s which is great news and a positive sign. We are cloudy right now, peaks of sunshine throughout the day today, but I would say as we sum it up, we were partly cloudy to mostly cloudy here. 69 South Bend, 69 Indianapolis. South wind at around 11 miles per hour for Indy, but wind staying between 10 and 20 tonight. As will remain, uh, those winds remain light to breezy for us. Tonight, 60s holding steady. Several rounds of showers and thunderstorms, but this is more of a scattered event for us tonight. As we look at it on future casts, here's what it looks like for you. So showers, thunderstorms, not severe. I'm not expecting severe weather tonight. This is rain that we're adding to the totals as we move forward throughout the night. Now, once we get to around midnight, I think we'll deal with kind of a surge of widespread rain briefly. I think it moves into central Indiana and you see this shower activity continue to move out. So this disturbance bringing rain kind of stays with us this week. Um, the showers every day is a chance. Tonight, temperatures remain mild, only falling to the 50s. 51 Indy, 48 as you look to the north, uh, and Kokomo 55 for you in Bloomington. So our nights are mild this week. Um, there are some cooler day, cooler nights in the forecast, um, but not as cool as something some of we seen last week. Tomorrow, 64 degrees. It's a cool down. Well, this is where our cool down takes us here at 64. As we look at the rain chance for us on Wednesday and Thursday, Wednesday we'll see showers and storms develop mainly in the afternoon hours once again. Thunderstorms, heavier downpours of rain. And as we get into your Thursday, I would say we start your day with rain on Thursday. Thursday's our wet day as we'll deal with showers, thunderstorms, and a threat for strong to severe storms in the southeast portion of the state as that system begins to spin through and move out. The good news is that we will dry out for the weekend, bringing much better weather. Um, I was talking about the warmer air that we have in play. Temperature outlook showing that through April 19th, holding on to some warmer air here. And here it is, Hensley Legal Group 8-day forecast. I think we can positively say here that we will not see daytime highs in the 30s and 40s. We will see some overnight lows get close to that. But we have officially settled into spring.